Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm very excited guys because I'm gonna share you a special trick which will definitely boost your productivity. So guys, if you are a front-end developer and you love to code in VS Code, then this video is gonna for you guys, yay! Alright guys, so without further ado, let's directly jump into the video. So I'm gonna open VS Code. Okay, so here it is. This VS Code is open. So guys, if you are seeing these files index.html, index.controller.js, so these files I have created in my last video. If you haven't watched that video, please watch it after watching this video. <laughs> Alright guys. So uh, let's go to this extensions. Search for the live server, not liver server guys. It's a live server. Once you see this, you should be able to see install button over here. I have already installed this live server. That's why it's not coming. I am seeing uninstall button over here. But anyway, you know that how to install the uh, extensions it's not a point but um, tons of features actually live server provides so our main purpose to use this live server here is that when we are making some changes in my index.html whether I have to add some components whether I have to add the label or change anything here and there maybe work on some styling in CSS and uh, maybe I have to add or modify some events in JavaScript then I have to explicitly click on the uh, refresh button in my browser right to reflect those changes so guys here the actual trick comes and live server come into the rescue that whenever we are making changes in our HTML CSS and JavaScript in front end side then we don't have to click explicitly click on the refresh button as soon as we are making some changes in HTML CSS and JavaScript it will immediately reflect in web browser right this is pretty cool so let's look at the demo first so so guys after successfully installing this live server once you uh, once you are in HTML page then click right click on it and uh, you you'll be seeing this option open with live server don't worry about this shortcuts because I'm using my Mac that's why it's coming like that if you are a uh, if you are a window user and Linux user then process would be the same so just click on this open with live server here we go guys this is index.html and this is very basic like only one button is there having one event definitely but if you see this is the index.html hosted in this local host and uh, 5500 port okay guys uh, let me put it side by side so that it will be easy to view and test it right okay okay guys now we are ready for the demo testing live live server okay guys as soon as I made the changes here it got reflected here without clicking on the refresh button live server is automatically taking care of refreshing the things hey that's pretty good so this is pretty cool guys if you see if I click submit button then this message is coming from the uh, you know index controller.js because I have used alert let's test this uh, JS file as well testing JS okay guys uh, let's click on submit button now okay guys we got this testing JS modified files without clicking on the refresh this is pretty cool guys I think definitely it will improve your productivity I love this guys one more thing if live server is not working in your system then make sure to update all the things all the softwares and operating system as well keep all the things up to date that's it for today guys i hope you learned something new if you like this video please don't forget to click on like button guys if you have any query and suggestions please write it down below i'll be happy to reply if you haven't subscribed it yet please click on subscribe button guys channel is growing very fast only because of you i just wanted to thank you guys keep supporting happy learning see you in the next video